nursery I'm just sending you a quick video to talk about number I put that in your learning log so I wanted to go over how we can show number in lots of different ways because you are all getting so good at your numbers you've learned some you've learned to count you've learned to, to use the number rhymes you've learned about lots of things about shape not just number but I wanted you to know about number but how we can show it in lots of different ways because you can count like one two three four five six seven eight nine ten that's counting amazing some of you may even be able to count back ten nine eight seven six sorry my hands five four three two one zero so you may be able to count back you some of you may be able now um and i've seen lily sent me a lovely picture of you practicing your numbers and Har harry sent me a brilliant one when you were doing all your numbers on the floor amazing and i've had lots of lovely lovely pictures of number but i wanted you to look at how to know numbers to 10 and how we show them in different ways so today i'm going to show you number five and then your task is to to go off and find me different ways of showing the other numbers. You may find them outdoors, you may find them in your house, and it will all become clearer in a few minutes. So I'm going to show you my dice. So this is number five, and we all know we've been practicing number. Down we go. We could either say big fat belly hat on the top, or down we go with a flag, uh, a round and a flag on the top. So that's five, but... Number five can be shown in so many different ways. Number five could be shown like this. Can you see the dots on a dice? That's five as well. And you've got to learn that these numbers mean the same thing. Like that is the same as that. It's the same number, but just shown in a different way. Also, five can be shown like this, can't it? Five fingers on our hands. Five. So we've got that, that, and that. Five could also be shown like this. A tower, a tower of fives. So you've got one, two, three, four, five. And it can be shown in this way, a different tower, lots of different colours. But that's five. That is the same as that. It's not written as a number, but it is still the number five. And that is the same as this. This is another way of writing five. Can you see? One, two, three, four, five. If I put my fingers there, one, two, let me put this one down, start again. One, two, three, four, five. So five can be shown like that. And I'm going to stick these on my board now so you can see them on. See, that's a number five. And have I got my pen? Let me get my pen. And I could write the number five. So we go down, big fat belly, hat on the top. That's five. Five could also be shown like this, couldn't it? It could be shown with five counters. So we could have, that's tricky, my one. Sorry about that one being white. I want a different colour. Two, three, it can be all over the place, they don't have to be in a line, four, five, I might swap that one for a black one because then you can see it a bit better, can't you? Can you see that? Oops, I don't think it's going to stick. Oh, there we go. Five can be shown, move this, five can be shown like that. Five, and I see if I can stick it this on now. Five can be shown like that. They all make five. And we could also have five like this. So I've got my animals here. That shows the number five. Can you see? One, two, three four, five. That's still five. It's the same as this. It's all showing the number five. And if I put this up, 
Whoop. I'm having a bit of trouble with my my resources today, aren't I? <laughs> but let's come on, we'll stick with it. Let's see if that'll stick on. Do you think it's going to stick on? Oh dear, that's not five. We need to have the other one on, don't we? There we go. And that's five as well. So what we could do is then put a big circle around it because we call that a circle map and that's different ways of showing the number five and you could even add we can add out dice and we've got our number haven't we there we go so there's your number five now your ta task this week i've given you some other things on your learning log to do so you've got um to add the numbers onto the pair of pants mm -hmm. and you've got some craft work to do to make sort of some treasure chests or a pirate using your hands but i'd like you to go looking for different ways of showing the other numbers try even if you try numbers up to five one two three four five and if you want to then you can look at different ways of numbers of showing numbers up to 10 no more than 10 but i think up to five is probably perfect so i'll give you a quick clip so you in your in your little post to me in Seesaw, you could find, you could make, just on a piece of paper, do a big circle and show me all the different ways you've made the numbers. Like I've got five, you might write the number four and different ways of how you've seen number four. You may see four leaves um, on a plant, that's showing four. You may see four cows in a field, four dogs in the park. Different ways of showing four. Now, if I show you four, you can include this in your um, post to me. If you look at the fork, that shows four, doesn't it? It's four little, what we call little prongs on the fork. One, two, three, four. But it also shows three. Can you see the three little gaps? One, two, three. You see numbers in lots of things. So that number, that fork is showing, is showing one, because we've got one fork but it's showing four prongs and it's showing three gaps. So numbers are everywhere. I open my chocolate bar. What number's gonna be seen? We could say number one, because there's one chocolate bar. If I open it up, that means I've got to eat it now. Oh, delicious, so I'm trying not to break it because I want to show you something. If I open up my chocolate bar, what number does that show? You see, ooh, delicious. If you look at this, it shows number four, doesn't it? One, two, three, four. Four parts on the chocolate bar. Mmm, delicious. What number does it show now? So numbers are everywhere. So your activity, <laughs> excuse me, is to make me a little circle map and show me different ways of showing numbers to five. Now, for instance, if you look at your face and numbers all over your face, my eyes are showing number two because I've got two eyes. But my nose is only one. And my mouth, there's only one. But my ears are showing two because i got two of them. Look at your toes. Lots of things you can do. I can't wait to see your posts. I'm really looking forward to them. Bye-bye.